Hello everyone, welcome back for a whole the sentence for our story today, which is called The Bug. Hopefully you've joined me for the jump in, so you've read the story, so you know what to expect. Remember, hold a sentence, my turn, your turn. When it's your turn, make sure you say it out nice, loudly and clearly at home. The more times we say it, it'll go in here, and it'll also mean that we won't miss out any words, so that we'll have a whole sentence. So, my turn. Get this bug off my chin. Get this bug off my chin. Get this bug off my chin. I don't think I would like to have a bug on my chin. It's actually just making me itch thinking about it. Oh, horrible. So let's look what we're looking for today then. We are after some capital letters at the start of our sentence. Show me the sign. We are looking for finger spaces between our words, a full stop at the end, ha, and once we get to the end of sentence, we'll all get our pointing fingers ready. We'll go back to the start and we'll read it out loud together. So there's a few tricky words in today's sentence. Listen out for them. Get this bug off my chin. What words do you think in there would be tricky? Let's have a look. I'm wondering if anyone can tell me what this red word is. This. What about this one? My, we saw those two yesterday, but there's one down here that we haven't seen in a little while. Off. Remember, it's the big f. Off. This, my, off. I'll point to them, I'll muddle them up and see if you can remember. My. Off. This. Well done if you managed to keep up. I've got some special friends down here in green. I know they're special friends because I've got an underlined them. They're in green. And we know the action to this one, I think. Can you remember? Ch -ch -ch -ch. My turn. Get this bug off my chin. Get this bug off my chin. Watch carefully for this one because I'm going to leave the tricky words up here for us today. You can have a look at the tricky words um, uh, in the classroom. They're always up on the wall anyway. So it's OK if you want to use these to look at them. If you don't want to use them, if you want to try and manage yourself, you can hide them and then write on your paper and then double check. My turn. Get this bug off my chin. Get this bug off my chin. Write it. Okay, let's see how you've got on then. Remember, we are looking for a capital letter at the start. Now, this is a tricky one. It's a capital G for get. And I didn't show you it before we started. So I'll make that the challenge today to practice a capital G. If you did manage to get it, if you remembered what a capital G looks like, give yourself a good tip. If you didn't get it, don't worry. We'll do our challenge today. And next time we need it, I know you'll get it right. We're looking for finger spaces between our words. If you remember those, pick one and give yourself a tick. We're looking for full stop. Remember, our full stop goes at the end of the sentence, not the end of the line. Get this bug off my chin. Full stop. Give yourself a tick. Now we're out of three ticks today. If you managed three, I'm going to say double pat on the back because that capital get is a tricky one. If you managed two, pat on the head, one finger clap. 
Now let's just double check our tricky words. If you didn't get the tricky words right, you might want an adult to set a timer at home and you can practice writing it as many times as you can for maybe just one minute and the adults will check that you're doing it properly because the more times you write it correctly, then you'll remember it. This. Can you find your word this in your sentence? Double check. Did you spell it correctly? Well done if you did. My. Can you find my? Got it. Double check. Did you spell it correctly? This one that was tricking us today. Off. Can you find off? Got it. Double check. Did you remember to do it correctly? Last one. Can you find our special friends? Ch. If you can find them, underline them. So you can spot them easily. Mine's is over here. Now today's challenge is to practice our capital G. Let me do one for you just so you can have a little look and you can pause the video if you want to or you're at it at home. They can maybe draw a couple and you could draw over the top of them. This one just here. Okay, thanks for watching. See you next time.